Good Friday afternoon. This van is empty. Uh, it's about 3.15 I think, something like that. So, unloaded the van, had some shred in there, went and picked up that uh, pickup truck box. He had it cut in like, I don't know, three or four pieces plus a tailgate. And then the guy right next door had a Coca-Cola cooler. And those, like, uh, it was probably maybe almost as tall as me. But it was like a, one of the refrigerator deals, so I threw that in the truck. So I ended up with like 900 and some pounds of uh, shred for $65. So then I went, <clears throat> my yard had about maybe eight computers. Which was, I think, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, so it was actually seven. So that went in that stack there, and then I went out to the other yard. I got those, those, that stack, that stack, and this stack. Uh, those three bottom things are battery backups. I don't even want them, but they were in the bottom of the box. So ended up with those. This catastrophe here. So I don't know what happened there. A uh, couple little router boxes there. A uh, bunch of these little router boxes. I've never seen these before, so we'll take one of them apart. See what's in it. A couple of tablets. A Wii. A video card. Nice uh, ceramic. Cirrus, that's probably about $75 a pound. Couple of loose memory CPUs, a uh, all-in-one, some uh, CD-ROMs, a couple old crapples there, but they cut the uh, cord off of them. So <clears throat> push down to close, push in to open. Push down to close, push in to open. So there you go. Kind of interesting. Big old, what those, five and a half, something like that. Uh, got this oldie here. Then a stack of uh, laptops. And a couple switches down there. And a couple of uh, old uh, IDE hard drives. So odds and ends. So not a lot. Uh, and then this large socket board and that board there um, I think that CPU came out of that one but the CPU this one here was just laying in the bottom of my bin so and some uh, appliance wire I don't know what I did with oh it's right here but I didn't look really good at this because there's some of that stupid degaussing cable in there and I hate that stuff Hate it, hate it, hate it, but most of it's uh, the uh, appliance. So. so, still not enough to make me smile, but it's something. It's something. So, oh, and I got a bucket of uh, a bucket of uh, half a bucket of cell phones. So, the cell phones, the tablets, the laptops, those all go to my computer guy who. Hopefully, we can come this weekend and grab this stuff out of here. Because that's going to fill up the shelves. <clears throat> and I got my two bins back. I haven't been to the yard in like a week, week and a half. And they still had my MLC one full. They ran back there and started unloading it. It's funny. So, that's about it. This this one here, I'm going to put on the shelf. Uh, Chris at Boardsport wants that one. So, we'll put it on the shelf so it don't get ripped up, tore up. Stripped out, whatever you want to call it. And I don't know what the hell this thing is. <laughs> Got a bunch of plugs on it. Eaten. So it must be like a... Uh, has some big cables on the back of it. Must be like a power backup or something. I don't know. I don't know. 
I'm just an idiot scrapper. What do I know? I don't know nothing. So I got a tote and a half of uh, mid-grade, high-grade peripheral. So I've just been adding to it, <clears throat> adding to it. But it is like 83 degrees here, and it is so humid. I mean, you don't even have to move, and you just start sweating. It's like really bad. So I don't know how much longer I'm going to be out here. I just don't know. I just don't know. But we'll have a Gatorade and we'll go from there. So just a quick update. Let you know what I picked up today. Um, I talked to the the big owner at the. Uh, scrapyard furthest out and he said that they almost closed the gates for a couple days uh because of the rain that we had and because it's so slow i went up there and that place is usually hopping there was nobody there but me the uh lot was freshly swept they're reorganizing the warehouse uh he said yeah it's just been super slow so he said it's like that every now my yard was you know they were a little busy this morning uh, and I told the, the big guys, I said, yeah, I said, I put an application in it, you know, for the one down here. Um, he's talking about taking another guy from down here and putting them back out there. So they're going to be short a few more people. So, um, like I said, I just have to figure out my transportation thing, getting back and forth there. And, um, you know, if things get any worse here, I'll just go there and, and work. He, you know, the big guy was like, there's no problem with that at all. So their uh, their wire mountain is huge. They have boxes upon boxes upon piles upon totes of wire that has to be cleaned. So um, we'll see what happens. Uh, if I can go work there and just do this on the weekends and still uh, get my stuff uh, like electronics and pile them up. And if I'm able to pay my bills with the scrap aluminum and wire and all that stuff, shred, then I'll just pile up my electronics and go down there with a big load of stuff. Make it worthwhile. So, had to figure that one out. Do some thinking this weekend. Uh, and see, I'm going to give my uh, computer guy a call. Have, or just send him a message to call me tonight. I don't exactly know what time he works till. So, uh... See if me and him can uh, hook up here and maybe get some stuff off of him and he can come and get this crap out of here or I can take it over to him or whatever. But gotta gotta get something going here. So if you guys have a good weekend, appreciate y'all. Maybe I'll see you over on uh, Irish on Sunday if he goes live. So until then, appreciate y'all. Stay safe. Keep doing what you're doing. I'll talk to y'all later.